I am Africa. I am the beginning of time. I am the breath of history. I am lush pastures, secret rivers, spiraling mountains. I am burning desert. I am snow-capped peaks. I am fertile earth. My swelling coasts are pregnant with hope and faith. My organs are full with life. I am radiant skin. I am 3,000 languages. I am history untold. I am endless mystery. I am honor and a voice. I am rulers and queens, tribes, passion, and antiquity. My continent is inside me. My spirit is strong. My vision clear. I am the Garden of Eden, the keeper of life. Diversity beyond comprehension. I am gold, ivory, and bronze. I'm abundance and rarity. I'm the scorcher of lips, the fruits of healing, and the land of bottomless spiritual waters. I am the land of the plagues and the blessing of color and song and dance and celebration. I am the birth of life and the test of endurance. I am Africa. Listen, before the coming of the other, I am proud, I am strong, I am imagination itself. I do not begin at slavery. I am not defined by this past. My people were forced from my bosom, dragged from the land of their ancestors, separated from their mother, glancing back at freedom. Forced into exile, rechristened but not undone, put to trial, stripped of their voice. But their hearts, their history, and their spirits survives. Here in America, I live on. Here, I am buoyant worship, an uninhibited dance, passionate prayer. Here, my church is not a spectator sport. It is a two-way conversation. My prayers are not silent. I rattle the gates of heaven in the name of Jesus. My reality is not in creeds or doctrines, but in the book of life, in shared stories, shared burdens, and love. The secular and the spiritual are intertwined. My worship is limited neither by time or place. It is in everything I do, everything I am. It is in my very bones. It is the balm of Gilead, the blood in my veins. The clock has no place. The future has no limit. Life in Jesus is a celebration, a thanksgiving, a glorious expectation. We cast off our coats of cares and enter divine presence. Our Savior meets us here. We are enveloped in light. I am not weak nor timid, but strong and proud. I have much to offer. I have much to share. Put down your phones, turn off the noise, cast away your limits, separate from the routine, awaken from slumber, expand your arsenal of praise, let go the tyranny of timidity, let the Spirit of God animate your dry bones and inhabit your skin. Make your voice heard, make it loud, shout to the Lord. I am Africa. I am America. I celebrate everything that was, that is, that will be. In my heart and in my hope, in my faith and in my vulnerability, in my sadness and in my joy, in my past and my present. Listen. I do not whisper. I do not hide. I shout my welcomes. I beckon you to join me. I invite you in with open arms. Come dance with me. Let us put away our separateness and our walls. Let us cast off our limits and our fears and create a new language, a new culture, and a new reality, and a new life in the true country as brothers and sisters in the eternal kingdom from which we can never be separated, never enslaved, but set free to our truest selves our purest hearts in a universal chorus of praise and song to the Creator 
the true giver of life. This is our faith. This is our heritage. This is our call. This is our promise. My invitation is clear. Come dance with me. Come dance with me. Amen.